Hey guys, welcome back in Korean Bangla YT and in this video we will learn how you can simply delete any file from you know in a, from our computer by using Visual Studio. So for doing this, first of all, uh, we will create a file in our temp folder that is my location of C drive user user app data local dot temp. Okay, at here I want that I want to delete a text file. Okay, just think that there is a useless text file with the name with one and the format is .txt okay i want to delete this file so how can i set up this in visual studio with c++ okay with .net framework so first of all i already add a button so let's double click on here so at here we need to first give our computer to give the direction that why the why, from where you need to pick the file so first of all set a string okay that string then you can set any of your string name then or set it that str then you need to set it that equals then we need to add a at the add will be specific give our computer or our visual studio give the command that bro from this location I need to pick so now we need to add this stuff and now we need to give the location that why we want to pick the file so that is the file location that is that user.cdx so then just paste this file and add a this stuff at here okay one is done now we need that we can this all the files okay from this temp file we all have this string we also need to give a specific that which file you need to delete so slash one dot txt okay so now he will be delete this one dot txt file okay so one is done we can now add make sure that you add here uh, on that at here you need to add that using system dot io and just add this stuff okay one is done now we can use the file okay from in from visual studio that file dot delete delete then first bracket now we will be set our str okay that is the string variable then just clone okay so what now it's do that it's basically very simple it will be get the from this location it will be pick this file at save in our str then our file delete can delete this string variable what we have the location of the value okay so when it's done we can now print a message at message box dot show first bracket then clone that done okay so now it will be give them messages okay so now we can save this file and now if I hit the run and now if it successfully delete the file it will be print the message or it will be don't print the message so let's click so as you can see it's telling that done now let's check in our files that are it's delete successful or not as you can see there is a no name with one okay so that's why you can delete at uh, that's why you can delete your files from your computer by using this command. I hope you like my video. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe my channel. If you have any questions, you can comment us in my comment box. Thank you so much for watching guys. Love you all. Bye bye.